안녕하세요. Hi everyone. Hi guys and welcome to the start of this video. This is going to be the second part of my January collective K-pop haul and we have some mail to open up today. So let's go ahead and get started. I have been doing quite a few trades already. Oh, this is so cute. They wrote, thank you USPS. That's so nice of them. So I think most of these are going to be trades, although I could be wrong. I'm really bad at keeping track of my mail and things like that. So we'll just have to see. Okay, so this is a cute note. Okay, and here we have a, yes, this is a trade. And this is the person that I traded with at Oishi Trades. Thank you so much for trading with me. I hope June arrives safely. Please let me know when he does. Stay safe plus healthy. So we did a cross trade, I believe. I honestly cannot remember which card I traded, but I got an ode, June, and it looks like they included some freebie stickers. So let's just go ahead and take a look. So here are some really cute stickers. Here is one of water and the moon, and then this is a stamp of Brussels. Oh, this makes me miss traveling so much. Okay, so there is that. And then this is the actual photo card. This is the non-beret hope version of an ode. Yes. I am the absolute worst at removing washi, so I apologize if me messily <laughs> ripping that open gives you anxiety. Okay, and here is June, and he is just the cutest. Oh my goodness. So yeah, that'll go right over here. So, oh yay! Okay, so this is very exciting because this is my first Jisung NCT 2020 card that I've gotten. Hi, thank you so much for trading with me. I hope Jisung arrives safely plus quickly. Please let me know when you get him. And it's from at Mina Trades. I traded a Yuta photo card for this Jisung. And guys, speaking of Jisung, he is actually coming of age in like less than a month. This is so exciting. I cannot believe how old he's gotten. Oh my goodness. So this is the NCT departure version. This is the ID card and he is so cute. Look at him with his little kerchief tied around his neck. Oh, I love the colors too. So there is that. All right, another envelope. <gasps> oh my god, and we are two for two for Jisung. So I also traded um, for this card as well. I traded one of my Heichan photo cards for this access card for the arrival version. And it reads, Ava, hi, thanks so much for trading with me. I hope Jisung gets to you safely and quickly. Please let me know when he arrives. Thanks again from Kathy. And their Instagram is Jung Hyuk Trade. Speaking of NCT, K-Town for You actually just announced that they were planning on restocking NCT's older albums. So everybody, of course, collectively flipped a shit. I ordered a bunch of the Empathy albums because I don't own any of the copies. And even though I have Jisung's cards already, I definitely want both versions of the album because I think they're so pretty. So here is his card and it is very holographic. And this is the last item. They have some very sparkly BTS spring day washi tape. Very cute. So we have, oh my goodness, okay. 
Oh, this is so cute. Okay, so this is, I think I know what this is. Oh my God, they wrote this entire letter. Okay, so <laughs> I guess I'll read it. Hi Ava, I hope you are doing great. I'm very glad you accepted this little Vernon gift. Like I told you, I went a little hard with my first Neo Kyo order. Let's be real, do we really have too much 17 in our lives? Nah, I totally agree with the statement. When I saw I had some cards you needed, I immediately reached out. Hopefully I could help you a bit with your collection. I know you only needed three cards, but I added a couple that I thought you might like. Oh my god, that is so sweet of her. Feel free to trade or sell them for cards that you need. Hopefully we'll have the chance to trade in the future as I am Hoshi blessed. Oh, oh, that's so nice. Happy collecting and stay safe. And this is from Sarah and this is her Instagram handle. It is at Jungcookie underscore. So this person actually reached out to me uh, because they watched my videos, which is so flattering. Um, I never really expected this YouTube to get that far. I honestly created it because... As a 17 stan, I just wanted to see more 17 content on YouTube, but I've had a lot of people reach out to me talking about how they've decided to pick up 17 or they've been a stan of 17, but you know, never really collected them until watching my videos and things like that. So she basically reached out to me and, you know, told me that she watched my videos and really enjoyed them and made her first Mercari purchase through Neo Kyo and had a lot of extra Vernon cards. So she wanted to give me and gift me some of her extras, which is just so nice of her and so not needed. But as someone who has a lot of photo cards to collect for an ode, I, you know, very gratefully accepted. And it looks like she also included some stickers, which she did not have to do because she's already giving me photo cards. But yeah, it was so thoughtful and so sweet and I'm so, so grateful. So thank you, Sarah, if you are watching this video. We just have a lot of stickers on here, which are really, really cute. And then a 17 freebie. And this looks like it's from their Boom Boom era. And then more 17 freebies because I'm your home. Oh my God, I love home. And then we have Vernon and more Vernon. Oh my God, he's adorable. So yes, we have some freebies right over here. And then let's get into the actual photo cards. So... She is Vernon biased. And I'm trying to remember if she also collects a second member of 17. I want to say Uzi, but I could be wrong. And I was missing quite a few Vernon cards for an ode. So she sent me a picture of her extras and asked me if there were any that I needed. Why am I so bad at peeling washi? Okay. Oh, so like, see, why can I not peel washi like a normal person? So here are, oh my gosh, she gave me so many. Okay, so here we have um, some of his, I don't have his cards memorized off the top of my head, so we are going to have to look. Okay, so this is Begin, and here's Vernon in a suit. This is his other version of Begin. Yes. Here is one of the truth cards. Nope, it's Poet. So ding, ding, not ding, 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 eh, 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 Ava. This is the K-Town for You pre-order card for Hengare. And then, oh my goodness, she has a HMV photo card, I believe, for semicolon. Yes. And then this is one of the HMV cards for 24 hour. Yes. So not too bad. Okay. So these will be going into my An Ode collection. And I guess I'll have these extra ones over here, which I can put up for trade. Thank you again, Sarah, so, so much. This is way too nice of you. So yeah, those are all the items from today's batch of mail. I will see you in my next clip. Hi guys, just coming at you with a quick opening of Resonance Part 2. This is my second copy that I actually ordered first, but was delayed because of Victim's delayed comeback. So oh, let's go ahead and I already got a look at the first card. I always forget how they store these. So, and here's the other card. Okay. So poster, 
sticker sheet. I think these might be different. I could be wrong, but um, here is my sticker sheet. And then the member that I pulled, I actually saw them, so not a surprise. But we got Jamin, and he's so cute. Look at him. I love him with the black hair. I feel like it's been a very long time since he's had that color. So here is the other card, and I believe it's face up. So we shall flip it like so, okay? And we got... Oh, we got Jahan. Oh my goodness. Wow. I got Mr. Jahan himself. Very nice. So these are actually going to be up for trade slash sale just for other things because I already have all the pulls that I need for Jisung. But this was fun and I will catch you guys in my next clip. Hey guys, we have a few things to open up today. I have this small package and then this envelope that has something bulky by the feel of it. I think this is an Etsy purchase that I made and I don't know what's in here. Um, so I guess we will find out. Um, oh gosh, I guess I could have just cut that open. All right. It feels like there's maybe Guys, I'm sorry, this is the most atrocious opening job. It feels like there's something lumpy, like candy, but that can't- <gasps> Oh, I know what this is! Okay, so this is a purchase that I made- Ooh, there is candy, okay. So this is a purchase that I made a few weeks ago, I think, but it came from Canada, so it took some time to get here. And it is this little pin. And it is a home run pin, which was the title track of Seventeen's most recent comeback. It is so gorgeous. Oh my god, that is so, so pretty. And that's what the back looks like. This is the name of the shop, Peachy Patches. And I believe they have an Etsy. Or maybe it's just a big cartel shop. I'm not sure. That's cute. And then here's a little freebie of Uzi. This is their handle. All right, okay. So we have that, some candy. Maybe I'll eat that in a moment. Um, sorry if I'm like a little delayed in my reactions. I actually just got off a night shift. So I am so, so tired and ready to fall asleep. This should be a, yes it is. So it's like a phone strap slash lanyard. And it is also 17 themed. I bought it, I found them through Instagram, but I bought it on their Etsy shop. Here is a little picture of Wanu. And then this is their Instagram, Twitter. And they have a big cartel shop. Okay. It's a pretty basic phone strap. It has 17 on one side with a diamond, and then it says, say the name. Okay, so those are the two things that I got. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in my next clip. Hey guys, a few things to open today. Everything is actually photo cards, I believe. Uh, I just have some that are group orders and or trades, and then this actually came from Korea. So let's just get this big boy out of the way first. I actually, ooh, let's pull this open. Aha, okay. So I actually purchased some photo, oh my God, this is so extra. I purchased some photo cards from a Korean seller, and they shipped this out really quickly. And these are DQ's treasure photo cards for their most recent release. I have this really bad luck where K-Town for You never ships my albums out on time. For whatever reason, they just hold on to it for a really long time. And then Customs likes to hold it hostage as well. So to save myself the hassle of scavenging for all of Q's cards, sorry, this is atrocious. I purchased his selfie cards on eBay for a really good price actually. And these shipped out a lot more quickly than I anticipated. So they're just in here. This was so beyond extra. I don't know why they felt the need to put it 
in a cardboard, a plastic bag, and then another cardboard bag. But these are his selfie photo cards from the Treasure Effect. And here we have all three of them. So he is a super cute. Let's just get them out of the sleeve. Yeah, so I didn't buy a whole lot of albums this time around. I just bought two copies of each version, so I would theoretically have enough to trade for the cards that I needed. But because Q is so difficult, I figured I would just buy a few of his cards and then trade whatever I can for both Jihoon and Q, and then sell my remainder. So here we have his, I think this is the pink version card. Yes, the pink selfie. This is his green selfie and then we have his blue selfie which I think is maybe one of my favorites either the blue or the green one so here he is so adorable very excited to have these I actually just got my albums this morning and I unboxed them on camera um, I was so tired when I filmed that so if you guys do end up watching that video um i apologize for my morning voice and incoherence i always seem to do unboxings at the worst time of day either really late at night after a long day of work or right in the morning um after i wake up so here's a card thank you very much and oh my goodness yay so i joined a group order to get jisung's resonance departure version card and this is our group order manager boba.wu I love this photo card. This is my favorite one of the bunch, and I'm so excited to finally have this. He's so cute. Look at his little handkerchief, and I love this Argyle vest that he has on. He's the cutest, and oh, he has the cutest signature as well. So there is that. And then there might be another group order somewhere in here. This one feels kind of bulky, so this might be it. Okay. And what is this? Oh, no, this is a trade. Okay. So I traded with this person, Jin Somnias, and she wrote, Ava, thank you so much for trading with me. I hope Oogie arrives safely. And this is the winter version photo card for Uki for I burn and I traded mini for her I believe oh my god this washi is, is so fantastic I love it and I love 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 all of Uki's photo cards for this release they're so cute but in particular I think the winter version ones are my favorite here she is making a little peace sign with her little bob. And she's wearing a wig in this photo, but she actually now does have short hair. And I wasn't sure how I felt about it initially, but it's really grown on me and they've styled it really nicely. And some of their most recent music shows, she has it in waves and she looks so cute. She's like this little doll. Um, yeah, I'm a big fan of it. Okay, and then, ah, yes, I think this is the group order, and, oh, she included freebies. Hi, <laughs> Karatume. Thanks so much for joining. I hope this arrives safely, and please let me know when it does. Wishing you the best right now, and please take care. All the best, Bianca, and that is her handle. She is a group order manager for a group order that I joined to get some Dino and Ode PCs. So there should be a stack of them in here. I think I got like three or four, I can't remember. But she's been super nice. I'm very happy to make some progress on an ode. And oh boy, yes. Okay. So here we have Dina with this little fedora. So cute. That is Whiteback Poet. This is Begin Version. Is it Blueback? Yes. Here we have Dino wearing suspenders. White Version Truth. And then this should be a real version way back. Very nice. So yeah, this was my little mini photo card haul. And I will catch you in the next one. Bye. Hey guys, welcome back. Uh, we have some mail and some packages to open up today. Let's go ahead and start with the mail. Okay, so... I've done a lot of trading for treasure recently, so I suspect that most of these items 
will be treasure trades, uh, but also who knows. <laughs> this is really nice washi tape. Can always appreciate a good washi. Okay. Okay, yes. Hello, Ava. I am so glad we were able to trade and help each other out with our treasure collections. I hope Q arrives quickly plus safely to you. Please let me know when this arrives and I hope you have an amazing day. And this is from someone that I traded with on Instagram, kpop.trades. Oh, she has a YouTube too. That's cool. Uh, P.S. I love your YouTube channel and your collection. Keep up the amazing work and thank you for inspiring me to work on my collection. Stay safe, healthy, and happy. And this is from Maddie. That is so sweet, Maddie. Uh, thank you so much. Uh, I'll be sure to check out your channel later on. And here we have DingQ. Ooh, and there are some freebies in the back. So let's go ahead and just look at those. We have some stickers. We have a really cute Yoongi doing a peace sign. Here we have Hyunjin and oh my god Jimin! Very nice. And this is the card itself. So this is one of the concept cards for the blue version. Yes. And here he is looking super dapper. Um, yeah, I really like the photos this time around for both the concept and the selfies. Also, sorry, there is a plane flying overhead because there always seems to be planes whenever I want to film. Okay, so next up we have more mail. Actually, let's... This kind of works. Okay, here is a really pretty card with... Ooh, I think, yeah, with some Simply Gilded washi tape. And, oh, yay! Okay, so this is a trade that I made. I can't remember which baby photo card I traded. It might have been Hyunsuk, but this is Q in here. Hi, I hope Q arrives to you safely. Thank you so much for trading with me. Plus, let me know when he arrives. And that is their handle, Rare Pinks. Uh, for those of you who don't know it, Simply Gilded is a shop that does washi and other stationery, and they make really, really pretty washi tape. They are kind of expensive, but they do have sales and deals every Monday or so, but a lot of my like holographic or shiny washi tape tends to be from this store. Uh, that or Etsy or AliExpress is where I get most of my stationery from. If you were curious, <laughs> um, yeah, so here is Q wearing a helmet of some sorts. To be honest, I'm not exactly sure what kind of helmet it is, but look at him. He's adorable. Ugh, such a cutie. And then when I was unboxing the albums, I didn't realize that they had the members' names in the back, so I kept on looking at all these baby photos, not knowing who it was, <laughs> and just being like, wow, this is so cute. Um... I'm so clueless, but yes. Okay, all right. Guys, there's so many planes. Okay, so this is the next card and we have, oh my gosh, yay. So I traded one of my Sejun K-Town For You pre-order cards for this Sungwoo card from either Make Star or MMT. And the note reads, hello, thank you so much for trading with me. I hope it arrives safely and let me know when it does. And that is their handle at Stray IIDS. I love this sunflower washi tape. <laughs> and it matches Sungwoo's hair, which is really funny. So for Sungwoo, I don't really have any hard rules when it comes to his non-album stuff. I don't generally make it a point to collect non-album, which is why I don't buy any of his like season's greetings or his fan club stuff. But when it comes to pre-order and fan sign cards, I tend to get the ones that I like. And also because I'll get ones if I needed to fill out a page and make it look nice. So here he is looking so gorgeous. His contacts match his hair and he looks so pretty. Oh, okay. So it's from Mixar. And that is him. Uh, 
when I went to open my mailbox, I was so excited to see it full with so many things. It's been pretty empty the past week or so because I didn't have a lot of trades or purchases, but it should be quite full in these next few weeks. Okay, so this was a purchase that I made from someone that I've traded with before and I know on Instagram. It reads, hi, thank you so much for purchasing. I hope Jihoon arrives quickly and safely. Please let me know when he does. Stay safe and healthy. Good luck with all these comebacks. And that is her name, Giselle, and that is her handle. It's 7 Chill. Um, she included a origami heart, which she tends to do. And I bought this Jihoon pre-order card from K-Town before I even got my albums because I figured I probably wouldn't get him. And <laughs> surprise, surprise, I didn't. I don't have a whole lot of Jihoon luck, which is okay. But yes, she is someone that I've traded with before. And we were talking about how I've been going crazy because there's so many comebacks and I just can't keep up with all the groups. All right, so here are his two cards. He is so cute in this one. Oh my God, that's what the back looks like. And then here he is, the concept pre-order card, and there is the group card. I've been on a huge Jihoon binge. I've been watching these like fan sign videos. There's this Korean treasure maker who uploads videos of like treasure content. So her unboxing stuff, her participating in fan sign videos. She's really funny. I'm actually gonna link her channel down below if you're a treasure maker and you like to watch that kind of stuff because she's actually like a really good YouTuber. Um, her edits are so funny and she puts captions so you can understand it if you don't speak Korean, obviously. But anyways, I've been watching a lot of, sorry, I'm gonna have to mangle this envelope because it's not sliding out. I've been watching a lot of her videos, and in her fan signs, Jihoon is just so witty and funny. He has this type of sense of humor that is exactly my style. So, um, yeah, I've been just like on a big Jihoon loving streak. <laughs> on that note, we are going to switch gears to Jinkyu. This was a trade that I made with someone. We exchanged first press cards. I think I might have traded a Hyunsuk. I'm not exactly sure. Anyways, hi Ava, thank you so much for trading with me and giving Jinkyu a new home. I hope you arrive safely. Please let me know when you get him. Stay safe and happy collecting. And it's from at Peachy Marky. And she included some sticker freebies, it looks like. Oh, I'm actually familiar with the sticker because I have purchased this before from AliExpress. And then here we have some other ones, really cute. Yeah, so I've had, I have an abundance of Haruto and Hyunsuk photo cards, so I'm assuming most of the trades that are coming in are from those cards that I pulled. Here is his first press AR card. He's holding this little flower and then holding his hand up to his ear. I actually love the back design for these. I think they're so pretty. very securely wrapped. Okay, so this is probably something larger given the size of the top loader. And it is, oh, <laughs> so yes, okay. So the person that I bought the Jihoon card from actually traded me her extra Junkyu postcard. I traded her my Yedam. I don't think she collects Yedam, but she was kind of helping me out, which was really nice of her. So the note reads, Hi Ava, thank you so much for trading with me. I hope Junkyu arrives quickly and safely. Please let me know when he does stay safe and healthy. Yeah, so she is a Hyunsuk and Junkyu collector, and she happened to have a bunch of extra postcards, and then one of them was Junkyu, so she offered to trade, which, like I said, is really generous of her. So here is his postcard. Thank goodness I only had to get one of these. So here he is. Oh my goodness. This picture is actually so adorable. I detest postcards with a passion, but this one's a really cute picture. So we'll accept it. Okay, can I just open this like normal maybe? 
Ooh, yes. Okay. So this feels quite hefty. Oh, okay. This is a Victon trade. So she and I traded both a photo film strip and a photo card. I don't remember her handle and she didn't include it, so I'll have to go look for it. But the note reads, hello, thank you for trading with me. I hope they get to you safely and please let me know when they arrive. I traded her my Subin photo film strip for Sungwoo. And then I had a Subin photo card that I traded for the group photo card. <laughs> and she used, what is it? It looks like Bubbly, which is a seltzer brand in America to store this. Ooh, very nice. I think it's so funny how creative people can be when it comes to protecting items. Like you don't have to have sleeves and big top loaders and things like that. You can get creative with what you have in your house. So yes, here he is. Oh my God. Okay, that is not acceptable. <laughs> um, he is such a beautiful man. Very happy to have that. Put him over here. And then this is the group card. Oh, look at all of them. They look so great in their costumes. That's what the back looks like. Victon. Very nice. Okay, I'll put that all off to the side. And then this, I know exactly what this is. Okay, so let me see which is the best way to open this. Inside here are two file card holders and they are some of the treasure inclusions from their newest album. I pulled Junkyo, but I still needed Jihoon. So this is someone who is a mutual of mine on Instagram who actually had two Jihoons. So I offered to trade her my Haruto because she collects Haruto, but it turns out as well that she has a sister who is an Asahi collector and I also had Asahi. So it's a whole long story that I'm not going to go into, but basically there was a mutual on Instagram who was trading on behalf of both herself and her sister and both wanted file card holders that I had, which were Haruto and Asahi. I only needed Jihoon and they had two of them, so I just offered to trade both my Asahi and Haruto for both their Jihoon, just so I could help them out. And yes, so I have two Jihoons now. And oh my goodness, Kinder. I haven't had one of these in a really long time. Anyways, so this is their note. Hey, thanks so much for trading with me. I hope Hoon reaches you safely. Let me know when he does. Good luck in your collections. Stay safe. And that is their handle. But here are my Jihoons. Very excited to have him. You know what, we're just gonna cut straight through. These are such a pain to package and trade slash sell. So I don't know if I'm going to put that much effort into selling them. I might just hold on to them and you know, whatever, because I don't want to deal with it. But here he is. Oh, he is so cute. So she has a blue one and then here is a pink one. So very excited to have them. Honestly, I'm probably just gonna put these straight back in the albums. I don't really have any intentions of storing these in my binder, but maybe I'll display one of them because I have two. So yes, that is that. You can go off to the side, my friend. And with that, we can go ahead to these two packages that I have. So this first one, I think they're a shop based in Canada, if I'm remembering correctly. And I bought some washies from them, which they've labeled in these really cute bags. Oh my goodness. So actually, let's read the note first. Um, oh, oh, hello. Okay, so many things. So this is their name, S-C-T-I-N-G. They have an Instagram and Etsy and a website, it looks like. Her name is Stephanie, and she has a really cute business card. I believe I bought this set of stickers from her. Okay, sorry, I had to wait for the, pl the plane to be done. I swear to God, I am cursed with planes flying while I'm filming. Anyways, this is a Hoshi sticker sheet, and we have cartoon Hoshi in various very cute outfits. So he's holding version 2 Carrot Bong here. This is his outfit from left and right. 
Um, here he is holding a clock that's pointed at 1010. This is from Semicolon, of course. Here he is in his Carrot Land 2020 costume. And then I don't actually know what this one is from. Um, hmm, I don't know. Anyways, and then here is a 17 videotape technology sticker, which is a reference from Clap. Here is a version two carrot bong sticker, and then she included this very cute Polaroid freebie of Sung Chol. Oh my goodness, I love it. Okay, and she, look at this little cute mini file holder that she put it in. I love the cute packaging. Okay, and now we get to the washi, which is the main purchase. Oh my God, this is adorable. Let me open it. So she made these stamp washies, so um, you can kind of rip it along the perforated edges, but this one is of Hoshi in various outfits. And then I also bought one with Jungwon as a bunny. And then here is Jungwon as a bunny. Here, I'll actually hold it like this. So super cute. Oh, I love both of these. That's adorable. Okay, I'll just move this off. And then finally, we have one more thing, and I believe these are keychains. Sorry, I had to cover that because there was some personal info in that receipt. Um, she included some candy. There is once again another plane flying overhead. This is so cute. So it's in this really cute craft bag packaging. Oh boy. Ooh, oh my goodness. Okay. I wasn't expecting them to all just be there. Okay, so let us start with this keychain first off. I bought this <laughs> 17, these are all 17 items. I bought this 17 keychain and it is so pretty. It reads, in this diamond life forever. And the keychain is in the shape of a diamond and someone is holding a pink carrot bong. I just think it's really gorgeous. Here's what it looks like. Next, we have a Oh My pin. And this is a reference for their music video because there is a scene where there's a ladder leading up to a door and there's a little chain right here, which is just really cute. Oh, and for those of you who are interested, this is the name of the maker, Groovy Star Pins. Uh, they have an Instagram and it looks like a Twitter as well and you can buy through them. Is it on Etsy? I'm not sure if it's on Etsy, but um, you can find their info on their Instagram page for sure. And then this is the pin that I'm most excited about. This is a semicolon pin. Uh, it reads 17, semicolon, now playing. And this is a reference to the music video where they have this big movie theater kind of display in the front where they all dance to. And she made this really cool chain slash crystal thingy majiggy yeah it's just really really pretty so here it is also it's funny because i'm not a pin person but i have so many 17 pins i really do need to get a cork board to display them all yeah so these are the items from today's mini haul and i will catch you in the next clip hey guys so two packages to open up today it's raining outside currently so i apologize if you can hear that uh, pretty loudly on camera i actually know what both these things are i'm very excited to be opening it let's start with this package right over here which i've been waiting for basically for months now i joined a group order for semicolon through this gom that i follow on twitter and she for whatever reason there were just issues with delays and it getting shipped to her Korean address from Weavers. So it's taken quite some time, obviously, for these albums to arrive. I obviously don't need any of the pulls in here anymore because I am done with my semicolon collection, but I am hoping to get the last two photo books that I need to finish my OT13 photo book collection. Here is her card right over here, uh, Simple Springs Group Order. 
And this is my first album group order through them. I have joined a few smaller things before and they're usually very on top of things. This was just something that was out of their control. Um, these are just the posters. Yes, for semicolon. I don't really do anything with my posters, so I'll just toss it to the side. Okay, so I need DK and I need Dino still for my photo books, so hopefully we get those. Oh, and then they inserted, it looks like both the lentis in here. So let's just see who we have. Let's see, we have, oh, we have Jungan! Oh my God, he's so cute. Oh, what a beautiful man. I can't quite get the lenti to do this thing, but there is Jungan. I don't remember what I ranked for these preferences, to be honest. And then we have, oh, we have Vernon. Oh my goodness, so cute. Okay, so let's move these off here. Actually, let's just put you right over here. Here, you can chill out on the sides. I don't think you can see Jungan's face really well <laughs> on camera. Okay, and then the photo book we got was, yes, we got Dino. And then I'm just gonna go through my pulls, which I assume they just all stuck in here. Awesome, yes. So we have the sticker, we have a Jun. Oh, we have Udi, a Jungan, Shua. We have a Udi and Shua, and then we have another Jungan. Look at all that, so much Jungan. Okay, so those are the pulls for this album. And then hopefully we have a Dokyam in here, do we? Yay! Okay, perfect. So I got the things that I wanted, which are mainly just the photo books. And then here are our pulls for this one. Vernon, Ming Hao. Ooh, two Ming Hao's. Another Vernon. We have Dungan and Dino, and then we have a Yeshua. So yes, and that is, I have so many of these mini posters. I don't know what to do with them all to be honest, but I am very excited to have these. Actually, let's just flip through it really quickly because I haven't seen the photo books, obviously. Ugh, Dokyam in a beret is so cute. I love when they put him in contacts. Oh, he's so cute. And then I like that he has this yellow color. Okay. And then we can also flip through Dino's photo book really quickly as well. You know, so handsome. Ugh, I love the colors. The orange and the turquoise look so nice. And then I don't remember, I think he's partnered with Uzi and then Jungan for unit photos. Oh no. Here is Songcho and Jungan. Okay, really cute. So, yes, those are those things. We'll put that off to the side right over here. And then next up is this package from K-Pop Music Town LA. And in here are two albums that I purchased because they had a pre-order for restocks for Oh My Girl's earlier albums. And I am so excited because as far as I know, ooh, there's only, oh, okay, they're both in here. Um, as far as I know, these are out of print prints, so I don't know where they got these restocks from. Um, here is their sticker. Um, let's just actually cut it. So I don't know where they scrounged these up. I don't think they have too, too many copies available, but I did get their first two early albums because I don't have them, obviously. I actually am not planning on collecting any of the pulls in these albums because they're not photo cards. And sorry, I'm just gonna move this. Because they're not photo cards and I'm pretty selective in how I'm collecting you all right now, but I did want this album. And this is their first album, so I figured I would just grab it too while I had the chance. And this is their first and second mini albums. So let's start with the first one. And we'll just move everything off. Okay, so I don't know what the name of this mini album is, to be honest. I haven't, I'm not too, too familiar with this era. I've delved into some of the earlier stuff, but really only from closer onwards. 
Oh my god. Okay. Wow, it's so funny seeing that compass sticker on there for this one. Okay. So, oh my girl, this is what it looks like. I won't go through the entire album, but we'll flip through a little bit. Oh my god, Jiho. So pretty. This is the member that left, and I'm really sorry, I don't remember her name. All right, yeah, that's her. She's super cute, though. Oh my god, Arin looks like a baby Benny. Oh, Sunny. So he was actually my first bias in Oh My Girl when I was getting into them while watching Queendom. Oh my god. Mimi looks so incredibly different. It's crazy to see how much they've changed. And then we have Yua. Yeah, oh, so here are their names. So let's see. Her name was Jine, that's right, yeah. Jine left, I think it was for health reasons, but I'm not exactly sure. So Oh My Girl is now a seven member group. Um, yeah, so these are the pictures. Ooh, they have some like old fashioned <laughs> photographs in black and white here. And they have like a member info sheet, which makes sense. This is their first album. All right, so I'm just going to go straight to the poll. And we have, oh my God, we have Aden. She's such a cutie. Look at her. Oh my goodness. I think there's only one item in here. Oh, and then here is a CD just floating around. Let's get you back into place. Yes, so there's only that one item, which is fine. Again, I am not collecting anything from this album, so that is okay. And then here we have Getting Closer, which I am so excited about. This is their second mini album and this was their first comeback of course i love closer it is one of my favorite title tracks by them and i think this album is so gorgeous i love how it looks like an old book oh my god they really committed to this theme um sorry i just woke up so if my voice sounds really kind of raspy that is the reason why and it's so pretty maybe we'll we will go through each picture in here very quickly so hyozeng again jine back when she was in there here is Mimi. You are oh so pretty. Sunhi. I love that plaid dress. Tiho. Vinny. Oh my god, she looks like little red riding hood. The pages are super thick. Aden. And yes. So Ooh, ooh. <laughs> I wasn't quite that expecting to be there. So it looks like we got Binny for the bookmark. Really cute. Oh, I love this era for them. I think the styling was very simple but gorgeous. And oh, it's very much so a, what's the word that I'm looking for? Like fairy tale concept. So we have these like mysterious woods. And then they're picking apples off of trees. Oh my God, Yua looks like a princess. Oh, this is so, so pretty. Oh my God. I love Oh My Girls concepts. But I want them to come back. Can they come back soon? And these outfits are so, so pretty on them. Oh. Sunny's hair is gorgeous. Oh, oh my god, Benny with long hair. What a cutie. I love that they have these little captions in here. It almost reads like a storybook. And then these are the lyrics and credits pages for each of the songs. Oh, Playground's a fun song. I really like that one as well. And then thanks to pages. And then we get to their CD. So yeah, I am just so excited to have this album. This album <laughs> sells for really expensive on eBay and Mercari. I thought about buying it for the longest time, but I could just never justify spending that much on an album, even though it's out of print and obviously being that rare, you know, albums do tend to go for that much. I'm just so happy that they restocked this and I finally own this and have it in my hands. It is a, such a beautiful album. So yeah, super stoked to have this. Anyways, thank you for watching and I will catch you in my next clip. Hey guys, welcome to the final clip of this month's collective haul. Today is January 31st, so that will be it for this month. I just have two things to open up inside here, uh, two trades or purchases, I believe. And with that, we can just go ahead and get started. <laughs> A little sneak peek of what's to come. It looks like it's... 
So a bit of a camera malfunction, and by camera I mean a phone because that is what I use to record these videos. I went to tap my phone screen to make it zoom in, and in the process of doing so I accidentally hit the blow-mo button, so everything that was filmed after that part is pretty much unusable. Um, I am still just going to open these up and show you guys what I got really quickly. So that first item that I was opening is a Jihoon photo card, and this is his first press. I believe I traded Hyunsuk for him and the person that I traded with is Jisoo underscore chicken four and they wrote thank you for trading with me stay safe so that is this photo card right over here and we have this very cute dog card to go with it and then the second item of the haul were these two Junkyu photo cards these are his K-Town for you pre-order cards and I traded with Darby is a multi-stan her note reads, Ava, thank you so much for trading with me. I hope Q gets to you safely and quickly. Please let me know when he arrives. So these are his cards right over here. This is the selfie version with the blue back. And then here is the concept card with the group picture in the back as well. So, so sorry about that really a bit of a letdown of the last clip for this month's video. But yes, this will be it for my January Collective Haul Part 2. I am so glad I broke it up into two parts because this second half is looking like it's going to be really, really long. Anyways, thank you as always for watching and I will catch you in my next one. Bye!